Every morning I get up and I say to the mirror, mirror, mirror on the wall, tell me who's the most brilliant of them all. What does the mirror say? That mirror ain't no gentleman, Mr. Green. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's something peering at us out from under that shrub. Please. <laughs> Could I have a picture of the bride between her first and second husband? Oh, really? I don't. Darling. Something like this, pretty thrilling? Uh, might I suggest that the two gentlemen look at each other? I don't know how to ask you this. I'm just going to come right out and say it. Are you gay? What? No, I'm not gay. You're quite a gal, Liz. Oh, I don't know. I take nice pictures, though. Night. Night. Well, the sensible people of the world will say, a fall de roll and fiddle de dee and fiddle de faddle de foddle. All the wishes in the world are poppycock and twaddle. Who wants to be a millionaire? I don't. Have flashy flunkies everywhere? I don't. Who wants the father of a country estate? A country estate is something I'd hate. And because these daft and dewy-eyed dopes keep building up impossible hopes, impossible, things are happening every day. Oh, here comes the groom. Malcolm Downey, how dare you get married without inviting your grandmother? But, Mal, you're gay. I knew it. Now are we getting warm? Very touching, very academy of dramatic arts. That bitter cynicism of yours is something you've acquired since you left Radcliffe. That cynicism you refer to, I acquired the day I discovered I was different from little boys. Ah. You know, one of the prettiest sights in this pretty world is the sight of the privileged class enjoying its privileges. Do you know, Jack, some people live all their lives without having anything as wonderful as this to show for it? I know, Mom. I am not going to let you turn into what he was, as God is my witness. Well, if and I was God... Don't you dare to take the name of the Lord in vain. May God forgive you. What's the trouble? Nothing, Miss Howard. It's just that Virginia feels a little faint. She got a little too much sun. I think she'll be all right. I helped you to get the presidency. And what are you doing with it? <laughs> I'd like to say one thing more. The heart full of joy and gladness will always banish sadness and strife. So always look for the silver lining and try to find the sunny side of life.